He's on his first trip with his backpack. Alright, so there's Axel. He's on his first trip with us backpacking. And then there's Chief. There's Chief back there. Oh, I got you all in the picture. This is one creepy cemetery in the woods. Just keeps going down there. I see way down there. What do you think, Axel? What do you think? It's pretty cool, huh? This is yeah, this is very, very cool. There, yeah, there's there's a trail goes back behind me and then all the way over to Missy. Oh, yeah. Chief go. No, I was just saying it. Oh, he found the gate to get in the fence. <laughs> oh, there's a bunch of uh, Indian pipe here. I showed some in my last video. What are you doing, buddy? See how Axel's doing? In memory of Oscar A. Kendall of the 14 New York Region Re Regiment, heavy artillery died in the service of his country at Alexandria V something, uh, 1864. He was only 18 years and three months. Three months. This is something that Aqua Tigger would like. Died in the service of his country, heavy, heavy artillery. That's that's pretty cool. Wow. And I like that it's got a fresh American flag there. Yeah. That's really nice. And, he... and we are in the middle of nowhere in the woods. So just a quick stop at a trailside shelter and, uh, you know, just do a few chores, let the baby have a nap. There's the baby's water for the, for the day and 
Axel is sleeping away here in the shelter. And this bug proof net, and there's the other baby. Got running water here, six liters at a time. Definitely love this thing. Highly recommend it. Yeah, cozy little spot for a extended break, siesta, lunch kind of deal. Yep. Alright, so we're going to continue hiking, get down the trail, leave our cozy little spot behind, and get off and find our next spot. And keep keep moving on. I think Chief's, Chief is over there in the bushes. There he is. He's spying on us. Little booger. I haven't even eaten. Hey, Boo Boo. Hey buddy. Hey buddy. Oh. <laughs> Hi. And mommy. Here. Oh. 
thumbnail time. Do you out of here, buddy? Taking off? Chief, what you got in your mouth, buddy? What you got in your mouth there? Did you eat some salad greens? What, what's that in your mouth, buddy? <laughs> yeah, Chief, you're not sharing today with your foraging? What, what's in there, buddy? What, I thought you were a meat eater. Meat only. You, you got a little something in your in the corner of your mouth, Chief. Uh, just, just right here. Just, just, it's right, right there in the, the corner, the other corner. <laughs> the, the other corner, buddy. Hilarious. Are you saving that for later? Are you saving it for later? Saving that for later, buddy? What do you think? <laughs> Tree. <laughs> <laughs> he finally got one. <laughs> he wants to, it's, I know it's a leaf, it's a serrated leaf. What kind of tree is this? I think this might be a bush of some sort. Yeah. Where is baby? Peekaboo! <laughs> nice. So this is the field that I ended up with out on this hike. We just are out of denatured alcohol. And the bugs aren't so bad, so I'm not going to build a fire.
Got the folder cup, made in Sweden, in the green. A little homemade bandana sock. It's just a little square sock. I made two out of one bandana. You guys have probably seen all this before. But my mini bull designs choke hazard is in there. This is a carbon felt windscreen. A pot stand, everything's in here. This is a the angry troll pot, the fosters fosters can lid and I always keep a little firefly titanium stove in here. Comes in so handy for when I only have a canister fuel. And just kind of flip these guys up. Chief. <laughs> so this is definitely no campground and we're we're out in the middle of nowhere, and this is pretty nice. No one's here. It's beautiful. Love it. Get outside and go do something. I think I got the whole clan in that shot. What? So a quick tip with the with the Starbucks Vias, I have some regular instant coffee also, and I tried the same amount, but if I put one of these guys, I can make a pot of coffee in here, I have three cups of coffee with this one for one of these, whereas the regular you know, regular instant coffee. The same amount of coffee gives me one one cup of coffee. So, and I just drink it black. And this is a simple way to get a a pot of coffee on the on the trail. Super lightweight. Just one pouch, three cups of coffee. Seems stronger too. So anyway, for you coffee people, it's a good tip. I don't feel like getting my spoon out of my pack, so this is gonna be sufficient for stirring my pot of coffee. And look, that's how much I got out of one Starbucks via. And look, I usually fill it up to the line, stop, enjoy that, come back for some more.
All right, so I'm guilty one more time. I got this picky bar that I just ate. So I just ate this picky bar and basically it was awesome. It tasted like a gingerbread man. It had almonds and pistachios in it and it's kind of soft with, with nuts. Cardamom. Yeah, cardamom, since it's got ginger, pistachios, turmeric, cardamom. Tastes like Christmas a little bit. And it's the Picky Bars, real food bar, built to fuel Moroccan Your World flavor. Moroccan Your World. Wilderness Rocks likes Moroccan Your World. That's hilarious. I like that. Hashtag life points. Hashtag life points. I don't know. I ate it. I ate it all up. I was hungry. I was grumpy. I ate it. Now I'm making a video not hungry or grumpy, so that's perfect. And uh, yeah, it's got a cool story on it. Four carbs and one protein. It's freaking science, dude, is what it says on the back. Picky bars. Get one. They're good. Yeah, they are. They are good. Don't tell anyone. So we keep moving him around to get him back into the shade because mm -hmm. his other spot is sunny now. See over there? So we just move him around. Chief's on patrol. So we move him around and he just finished his bottle. He's hanging out with Mama. Mama! This is really dry, so we're really thankful to have this water. Just just so you guys know, the bugs are kind of bad, but we have plenty of protection. This is one of those uh, bug shirts. That's why I have it on. Open to let some of this uh, moisture out from hiking and carrying this, this baby. Let's go see what they're doing. Let's go see what they're up to. You got mama's hair? Always. Yeah. It's always. Get your press up. Yeah. Tell everybody hello. Alright. <laughs> There's Chief. Yeah. They might need to check it. Family vacation.
Joe's Neon has one also. <laughs> and Joe's Neon, I'll tell you the story. Joe's Neon is my buddy and he showed his Six Moon Design Lunar Solo. He showed his and I had been jealous of all the Appalachian Trail hikers I had hiked with in the past and on the Pacific Crest, Crest Trail especially, I was jealous of them. But finally I was just like, you know, I'm just gonna get one that's perfect for our little family. And now Joe, Joe's Neon and I both have one. We've got a club, right Axel? The Six Moon Design Club. No, but it's an awesome, awesome tent. You can check out his review on his channel, so. Yeah, in 2010, I had the, the Contrail, the tarp tent. I love it, but I wore it out. And I thought I wanted this one to switch it up because I like the side entrance on it. Um, they're both awesome tents, perfect for what they are. You know, and it's just time to change it up for me. What is it? What's wrong, Bubba? Chief, come. Let's go, let's go. <coughs> Axel, look buddy. Whoa. <laughs> Are you hiking? Are you hiking? I better pay attention or we'll both be falling. Chiefy, say hello to everybody. All right. Hello. So we've raised baby Axel in the woods for six months now. We're finally bringing him out into the city, into the civilization he's a wild man wild baby wild baby in the sun Axel Zan not Tarzan Axel Zan Baldy Axel Zan Van Dam Axel Zan all right I think we hiked too much we're getting silly <laughs> Go. Keep coming. Axel. Hey, boo. Hey, buddy. Hi.
I'll see you guys next time. Oh. There he is.